In today's video, I'm going to discuss circle swim. This is a pool lane. This is an exercise bike. While an exercise bike is designed for only one person to use at a time, a pool lane is designed for multiple swimmers to share. By swimming on the right side of the line that divides most pool lanes, multiple swimmers can share the lane without running into one another. Let's watch it in action. My youngest is swimming away from us on the right side of the pool. My oldest daughter is coming in to complete a flip turn. She turns and then switches over to the right side of the lane. My wife is following. It's kind of like driving down a two-lane highway. By staying to the right, we have three swimmers of different abilities sharing the lane. When teaching young kids, you have to do more than simply tell them to swim on the right side. Use these drills to help them understand circle swim. With really young kids, I'll print out a simple picture of a pool lane. Then I'll tell them that the shark and the stingray guard the center of the lane, and the little fishies have to swim around them if they don't want to get bitten. Have the kids swim the toy fish around the lane printout. You get to be the shark. Guard the center of the lane. Another simple way to reinforce proper circle swim is to have a duct tape pool lane right on deck. Have the kids walk around the lane for practice. Keep an eye on them though. Passing etiquette. While younger swimmers are small enough to pass down the center of the lane, older kids and adults should wait until the end of the length. In a swim team environment, a tap on the foot signals your intent to pass. The slower swimmer stays to the right while the faster swimmer passes on the left. At the turn, the slower swimmer follows the faster swimmer off the turn, and the swimmers in the lane continue circle swimming. Ultimately, circle swim enables multiple swimmers to utilize a pool lane at one time and helps maximize pool efficiency.